At Burkitt Fluid Control Systems, we've identified the need for the hygienically designed process valves, uh, specifically for hygienic processing industries, pharmaceutical, food and beverage, um, water treatment. Uh, this is part of our element range, which is an extension of our classic plastic range. The range has uh, on-off control heads, modulated control heads, is flexible in that it has angle seat valves, globe valve, diaphragm valve options, which allows enough variance and flexibility for process engineers in their system build. The on-off control version has integral pilot solenoid valves and integral feedback switches. The modulated controller can either be a smart positioner or a full process controller with PID. This allows more simplified local control. The main features of the valve are the flexible control variants, the cleanable exterior, uh, low compressed air usage. Uh, you can use it on field bus applications, property bus for sure. Uh, the on-off control heads, the continuous control head flexibility. The plug has characteristics which give you very, very long service life compared to maybe rotary bore valves. And this could be part of a, a standalone system. Uh, it could be part of a, a larger process control plant. With the control heads, you would be feeding back to a PLC with an analog or a 4 to 20 milliamp, 0 to 10 volt output. These valves would, would typically go up to anywhere from uh, half inch to four inch. Uh, we do some smaller trims for the half inch valves. Depending on what the working part of the valve is, where, again, whether it's diaphragm, uh, angle seat, or globe, that would dictate to the, the media going through it. So it could be steam, water, uh, direct food and beverage application where hygiene is important, you could use a diaphragm. You have that flexibility. This is uh, the continuous modulating control head, which can be a, a process controller or smart positioner, depending on the application, depending on whether you're looking at standalone applications or part of a, a bigger turnkey uh, automated solution. The screen would show you really what you're trying to control, so whether it's flow, level, pressure, temperature, pH, conductivity, ORP, this would give you the information which you need to be able to control those parameters. So it could be a flow rate, it could be a percentage opening of the, uh, of the valve what output you're giving, what input you're giving. You can have decentralized local control by directly taking out the 4 to 20 or the 0 to 10 volt from the process valve directly into an instrument and there's no need to relay that by a, a third party PLC. Within this range you've got a number of different actuator sizes that you can pick and choose depending on what the application dictates and because you've got that flexibility you can choose an actuator that would give you lower air consumption. So if you've got 20 or 30 of these valves on your site compared to conventional process valve, control valves in particular, you'd be looking at saving one kilowatt hour.